Hello everybody, this is Matt Cat Sphere, and I just want to upload a video uh, to talk about something that is uh, was very, very cool that happened to me. It was kind of cool and kind of a little bit troubling. Um, it's my attempts to self-levitate. And this was just um, just like two months, so like a month and a half in of uh, doing basic psychokinesis, uh, being able to perform the ability to spin a side wheel and all that I had great success. I uploaded the videos. And um, just a little while, I started to ponder about the other things, the other extraordinary abilities that we are able to do. I believe that we are able to do, and that was some limitation. And what happened was, was that I, I actually was try, uh, trying to do it. I was laying on the be bedroom floor in, in my old apartment. And uh, this was like around 11 or 10 at night. And um, I was starting to make, trying to think of myself being light as a feather trying to feel as though uh, my body was leaving the ground, separating from the, from, the, from the ground, trying to feel it, trying to imagine it, trying to get into it. And then something uh, happened. My body was starting to react to my intentions and my imagination of what I was trying to do. And what happened was, was my stomach was affected. It was the first thing. My stomach was starting to become affected immediately. And this was just like a uh, Maybe 20 minutes, almost 30 minutes of doing this, laying on the ground, just doing this thing, trying to develop my own technique, trying to get something going. And then um, my stomach started to feel um, like there was air building up inside of my stomach. There was air building up. And uh, at first I was all, hey, hey something's happening here. My, uh, uh, my body is doing something. And then um, I stopped for a little bit and I got up. And I started to realize that I, uh, is, it, it was kind of troubling. I started to have a little bit of a uh, of, of discomfort from that. And it started to feel bloated. It's, my stomach started to feel bloated, like there was too much air going on there. And um, then, it, <clears throat> then I had to go to the doctor. And it was bothering me for two weeks. And I had to get medicine. And and then, it, 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 you know, uh, um, I recovered. My stomach was you know, OK. I felt all right. But the main thing that I want to get out was that, you know, that that the body, my body was reacting to something that I was intentionally trying to do. My body was reacting to was to to something that I was trying to do, which was self levitate And uh, that's the that's the thing that that makes it so real and so concrete that it, it can be done. And, you know, that right there is like a very surprising, ensuring thing that something is going on but the thing is though is that I was also very um very unhealthy to you know I um you know my, my I think that my stomach you know had like a, a like a little virus inside of there and uh, I, I was drinking a little bit you know like like just like a regular person I smoked cigarettes once in a while I ate junk food and and um I, I think that 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 type of thing um it clashed with what I was trying to do and I think that if I was a little more healthier, you know, if I took care of my, my body more and it feels more clean, my stomach was more clean, I got more fiber, if I, if I put more fiber, have more fiber in my system, clean out my, the, you know, get some um, probiotics, you know, those those food things and uh, and kind of clean out the system, I think I'll probably have better results. And, 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 and then I tried to do it a second time. And this was um, in my new apartment, I tried to do it again. And I was, um, and, and, and again, I think I was sitting down in the lane. And again, I, I, I thought that, oh no, you know, the first time was just a fluke. You know, my stomach reacted. It was because I was sick and it had nothing to do with, with my intention of trying to levitate. But then again, it happened again. My stomach reacted. My body was starting to react to it. My stomach became bloated again, filled up with air. And I started to have discomfort. But, uh, but I recovered again without going to see a doctor. And so, and so the thing is, though, what I'm trying to say is that, is that is that something is happening something is happening where the body is is trying to execute of uh, your intention it's trying to engage itself to what you're trying to do the body is immediately trying to do it and, and, and I, have, I put a lot of faith into it you know i put a lot of focus into it i was trying my best to, to levitate and my body was getting into it but since i was kind of unhealthy my stomach was the first thing to get a bad reaction to that and it affected me and made me sick. And you know, um, the, also the thing that I've been thinking about is that what it is that the body is doing is doing something that is what it knows, the nature of 
of flight, of buoyancy, is that you know you think about birds. You think about birds. They of uh, some birds have um they have inflation in their stomach. They create a form of inflation. They always have inflation in their stomach for them to have a buoyancy in the air. And they uh, they balance themselves with their wings as they glide in the air with this buoyancy in their stomach that gives them much more oomph to kind of be in the air. And I think that what it is is that um, the body is trying to to uh, to achieve this this ability through the naturalistic um, um, history of, uh, of of what of what nature the what what uh, what technicalities and things that nature gives the animals of the of the animal kingdom and 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 and, and this is what the, the, the body was trying to do is trying to reenact uh, the inflation of a bird's stomach that allows them to be buoyant in the air which the birds also have hollow bones too but there's one thing you know few birds they're able to do that and they do that through the buoyancy of inflation of the air in their stomachs and lets them go in the air and I think that the the, the the human body was trying to react and trying to achieve this by creating this um, inflation in the stomach as what birds would do what birds do in nature and it's it, the body was trying to do it in a naturalistic thing a, a logical thing that it, it the only way that it knew flight could be done a buoyancy or it, or or being able to levitate or being able to float up which is like inflation of something and trapped air something to allow it to float up in the air and so that's why i think what's going on and so just to close this all up i just want to say that you know i think that something is happening some levitation is possible i mean nothing is a possibility moving sliding your cups i mean i mean it's kind of a dumb thing to say that that, that you know after knowing psychokinesis nothing's impossible but self levitation is just another thing another level of that uh of that challenge with psychokinesis of human ability and so I, I truly believe that what was happening to me my body was reacting to what i what my intention and imagination what i was trying to do so something was happening and I think that it just needs to be more healthier. Clean up your stomach. Be overall just be more healthier. Don't smoke. Don't drink. Don't eat uh, uh, greasy foods, Burger King, and all this stuff. And uh, just eat healthy. Drink lots of water all the time. Teas, fruits and vegetables, and all that stuff. Uh, Ornaments will help. May help. But something is going on. Something was happening. My body was reacting. I got sick. Which you know, if I never tried to do it. I would have been healthy but since I did it something happened and it reacted to what I was trying to do so that's that's the the proof I tried it two times and I got sick from it and uh, my stomach was hurting so I'm gonna try to do it again and, and of course you know we all have dreams of flight and it's possible and it is but you have to be healthy and this is Rich's Space that's my story of me trying to self-levitate thank you guys for watching Mad Cat Spirit